I'm still sitting outside. And still on symptoms. Another question that's often asked regarding blood oxygen levels or saturations is why do my saturations dip suddenly and at what point do I need to worry? Well, in recovery from any illness affecting the lungs, it's quite normal for oxygen levels to be at risk of dropping. And they'll particularly drop when we're trying to do something, particularly exercise. Now, exercise in this context post-COVID might be different to what you thought of as exercise before. It might be simply getting up from a chair and that can cause people's blood oxygen levels to drop. It's because there's a sudden demand for oxygen by the muscles in the body. They're extracting more oxygen from the blood. When do you need to worry? Well, Numbers aren't the be-all and end-all, but they're a good guide here. This is about how low the blood oxygen falls and how long it takes to recover when you rest again. As a rule of thumb, if the blood oxygen levels are falling to a level below 92% and taking longer than a small amount of time, perhaps 30 seconds to increase back to normal, then that would be an indication to seek some advice and seek some help. In the first instance, phone 111. If you don't have underlying chest disease pre-COVID and if your saturations are falling to below 88% at any time, then again the same. If you've had underlying chest disease, perhaps COPD, then we'd set the bar a little lower. But again, if your saturations are dipping below 88% for any prolonged length of time, longer than 30 seconds or so, once you rest, then I would seek some advice.